right, Philippe loved his girlfriend, but he slept with her sister while doing the laundry. Uh-oh. And what does mom have to say to these two sisters? Take a look. Well, Jerry, I made a big mistake. Um, I slept with my girlfriend's sister. Ooh. How did that happen? Well, she um, asked my girlfriend to move in about a month ago, and I had told uh, my girlfriend that it was a bad idea. And about a couple weeks ago, uh, we went to go do laundry, and we were doing laundry, and I just started talking to her about all the things that happened between me and my girlfriend. Yeah. And how she's left me three times, mm. and to the point where I couldn't, <laughs> when she left me, I couldn't eat, I couldn't sleep, I couldn't do anything. So all this over the open over the laundry. Yeah. yeah. So we ended up just going to the restroom and I had sex with her. <laughs> I don't know why I did it. It was a mistake. I regret it. Yeah. Cuz I would do anything for my girlfriend. Yeah. My kids. And how long ago was this? A couple weeks ago. Okay. Now her sister, the one you had sex with in the bathroom, she's still living with you guys. Yes, she is. So you see her every day. Yes, I Was do. it awkward, like, the next morning? It's very awkward, because um, I'm not the cheating type. Yeah. Even after she's left me, I've still taken her back. I've done everything for her. I do everything at my house. I take care of my kids. So what happens, like, when she comes down in the morning for breakfast? Do you guys kind of avoid each other's eyes, or...? Yeah, we still talk, but, yeah. like... Not like it was when she first Now, she came. obviously hasn't yet told your girlfriend. No. That's why I'm here today, because I believe that. I feel that I need to let my girlfriend know. Okay. And you don't want to leave your girlfriend. You're here to no. just say, it happened, and I'm sorry. Yeah, I love my girlfriend to death. I would okay. do anything for her. Um, Bianca is your girlfriend, yes. right? Okay. Well, she's outside the studio, so she hasn't heard any of this. I'll let you tell her. Let's bring her in. Here's Bianca. <laughs> Baby, you know I love you and my kids more than life itself. You know I would do anything for y'all. I love you so much. But I just want to let you know that me and Juicy slept together. Oh. I'm sorry. I didn't mean for it to happen. Why? I don't know why it just happened. But my sister, Felipe? I don't know what to say. Like, I regret it. I'm sorry. That's yeah. all I can say. You know, I know that's your sister. I don't know, Felipe. Do you love me, Bianca? Yes. Because it feels to me like I love you more than what you love me. I still, I wouldn't be here right now if I didn't. It's why, do you, why do you love me, Bianca? Why? Because you've been by my side through everything. It's already been three years, okay? Yeah, I left you and you took me back every time. I mean, I love you, come on, like, we were almost homeless, and I still stood with you. I could have went back to my mom's house. We were together in the rain, and I still didn't leave you. We had no food, and we were just going to starve together. I'm pretty sure that should tell you a lot. Hey, why don't you help me around the house? I asked you to do one little thing. And it'll take you hours before you even think about doing it. And I just end up doing it myself. Your daughter could be asking you for, our daughter could be asking you for attention. And you'd rather be on Facebook. Come on, she could be there crying in front of you. You don't do nothing. You just sit there and stare at her like she's stupid. Right? Yeah. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. When did this happen? A couple weeks ago when we went to go do laundry. It happened in the laundromat. The laundromat? What about the sister still living there? How does that work now, now that you know? What's your relationship with your sister? Me and my sister are really close since we were younger. Um. I just wouldn't, I mean, two years ago I heard 
about them? This has happened in the past? You and her sister? No, it was just a rumor. I had, I had got mad at her sister and um, I guess I made a lie saying that she was trying to hit on me. I see. Well, let's bring her out. Here's your sister, Juicy. Yeah! You're overreacting. No, I'm really not, Juicy. You really are. You're making this a big issue. It's not nothing big. It, it was, is a it big issue. It was just issue. a hookup. No, it's not just a hookup. You had sex with the father. Okay, I'm young. I'm going to have fun. No, this isn't fun, Juicy. You partying is fun. Okay. You're, not You're mad because you're stuck at home all the damn time. <laughs> Do you feel a, a little bit bad? No. I mean, they trying to have a relationship. This is your sister. Why wouldn't you find some other guy? Because I'm going to do what I want to do. They, they let you move in. I mean, yeah, they're being nice to you, right? Yeah. So wouldn't the proper thing to do if they're being nice to you? I is... mean, but it just happened. I didn't plan on it for oh, happening. Oh, you, you didn't? Okay. <laughs> So you have no interest in being with him? I mean, he's kind of cute, but like, I wouldn't be with him. I don't want him. All right, let's, uh, who is Melissa? Who is Melissa? It's my mother. It's their mo it's, it's their your mom. mother. It's the girl's mother's. Oh, here's their mother, Melissa. Yeah. Yeah, really. I thought because of you, because you weren't taking care of your man. You were too busy running away. If you would have been home and learned how to be a mom and a wife instead of on Facebook, none of that would have happened. That doesn't get no. It doesn't. No. What? Take care of your man. Learn how to cook for him once in a while. He got what? With, he what? got he got with me like this three years ago. So what? That's not the. But, but he gave you three years to grow up. Three years to grow up. You should have thought about it before you sprayed your legs and had kids. Oh. You, what? What, no, what is it? I got okay, you. What is it, man? Why are you being a whore? Why are you sleeping with your brother-in-law? Look at you, mom. What? What about me? What about me? Look at you. What did I do? Really? But uh, yeah, what is it? You're the main so you're reason why I am the way I am. So you're a follower? I guess. Don't you make me beat your ass like you remember that tape trip being gay? my life to God, not change. Okay. Don't make me go gospel gangster. Okay, you, what is it? Okay. Gospel gangster. Gospel gangster. Oh. I gave my life out to God. Change and everything. This girl, every day, I got to wonder where she's at every night. Who's she laying up with? With some random people? Then fighting out? She laid up with Felipe and you. The me father what? of my granddaughters. Okay, and Melissa. And what? Why don't I you start our business, Stay in your business. Yeah, you put me in business. your business when you huh. gave me them grandkids. Huh? Huh? What? You can't even take care of your marriage. I can't. And what? I can't. You have to chill with We're my daughter. Together, right? Of We're all these together, girls right? out there in the streets, you have to I take, take care, care of my kids, right? You do take care of I them. I take care of my Stop kids, right? Stop asking me for money. Asking you for money? money. Who do I ask you for? I take care of your kids when oh, you're out there yeah. clubbing. Okay. What is it? I swear, get this boy out of my face oh, yeah. before I throw okay. my shoe at him. Yeah. Okay, think about the gospel. Mm -hmm. so, you know what? I've raised, I wasn't the perfect, perfect mother. Growing up without a mom, I've learned from my mistakes. And I forbid that my daughters will grow up to be like me. Okay? Especially disrespect each other, disrespect family. And they're not thinking about everybody else that they're hurting in the family. 
You know, that's what hurts the most. If they don't want me in their, in their business, don't ask me for money. Don't make me be the babysitter three, four days out of the week. What is it? Okay. If that is true, you're going to her and asking her to be a babysitter once in a while, you're asking her for money. Okay, if you do that, you realize, I'm not saying the way she's doing is necessarily appropriate, but you're asking her to be in your life when you keep going to her asking for help. That's inevitable. Okay, what's gonna happen here? What's gonna happen here with you two? Jerry, I love Felipe. We've been yeah. together three years. I mean, We've had our ups and downs, but I would, I would love to like happen with him. Okay. Well, that means you probably have to stop. And you, and you, you guys, I believe. Look, I just met both of you five minutes ago. I do believe you probably do love each other, but that means you really do have to start doing things around the home with your child, etc., more so than you're apparently doing because he's getting upset. And you've got to be faithful. Because that, your life, the spiral of your life is going to be horrible. It really is. You know, forget the television. I'm just telling you, you're going to screw up your lives. Straighten it up. You're two nice kids and you can have a good life. Don't do this. We'll be back. Hey, YouTube, thanks for watching. For more Judge Jerry, click here. For more Jerry Springer, click here.